Hello and welcome to Crossword Joe. This is Monday, 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 February 5th, 2018. This is yesterday's puzzle uh, by Fred Biscoff being combative. Unfortunately, it didn't keep yesterday's answers, but I do want to give you a treat here. I want to show you uh, our up to date um, list compiling uh, completion times. This is listed by the the longest average completion time. So these are like more or less the, the harder Arthurs. You know, the, their product takes me longer to, to do. Now, he only has one. That's probably a misnomer. That's probably from the first month. But uh, Fred Biscoff, he has got a solid 16 minutes, 16 and a half minutes. And then the other one that uh, you know, Patrick has 12, so these guys have the vast majority. I think they have two thirds. Both of them combined have two thirds of all of the all of the uh, puzzles. But he's only at 14 minutes. So see, look at there. There's almost a two and a half minute difference between those two, which I thought was kind of interesting. And be, you know, as time goes on, we'll see if trends uh, continue. Maybe we'll we'll uh, have other kind of graphs. Let me know in the comments what you want to see, but. If you noticed, uh, I think it was yesterday or the day before, I dipped below the 15 minute average. So it was like 14, 59, something like that. But now it's gone back up over 15. And this is where it's been, if I was to guess, you know, over the last few years, right around 15 minutes. And, uh, but let's see if we can get below that or again, see if there's trends. I, I, I just envision, you know, looking at maybe trends per author or whatever. Again, uh, if this kind of stuff uh, interests you, uh, or if you want to see something different, just uh, leave me a comment. But uh, let's go back to today's puzzle and go through our routine. We want to change it to expert. I think we were on regular both days this weekend. So uh, let's see if we can turn that around. Click on and off of sound effects, otherwise we get that annoying chirping whenever we hit a letter. And go to today's puzzle, which is barnyard babies. So it's probably going to be piglets. It's going to be uh, what else? You know, those kinds of things. Probably within the uh, within the certain answers, the certain parts of the theme. Okay, pie target in slapstick. That's a face. You throw a pie at someone's face. Home to a pet rabbit. Um, Cage, fence, don't know. Impatient driver's attention getter. Honk, horn, the horn, let's see, let's see, this, uh, having a foul 11 down. I don't know what that is. Let's see what 11 down is. There's gonna be an O, right? Garbage scowl emanation, odor. So, having a foul. I don't know what that is. Maybe this is in need. Yeah, so this could be probably horn. I was spending a lot of time on that one answer. Well, we shouldn't do that. We should just fly through this. But that's okay. Site that started as auction web. I'm going to say that that's eBay. In unison. As one. I'm guessing. A drool pool creator of comics. Well, that'd be Garfield's favorite doggy, Odie, not Opie. That's in uh, that's in Mayberry RFD. Odie is the one we're going for. Blank decor, home design magazine. Hmm. Cracked corn. To chill. That's feed. So that's E. Uh, far from inept, able. Okay. Achilles tendon. Attachment is uh, Achilles is, is attached to the calf muscle, right? So that's gonna be the L, and the upper canines are eye teeth, so that's gonna be L. So again, we spent a lot of time doing that, but we, we filled it out. Beginner, beginning skiers area, um, bunny hills, something like that. That would tie into today's answer barnyard babies because uh, baby rabbits are bunnies, right? But it's Bunny Hills? No. Uh, we'll see. I'm just gonna put in Bunny. Just to show that, you know, we, we've seen that. We think we know what's going on here. Displaying Dexterity. Um, that's gonna be a D-E-F uh, Dexterity, Deft. 
death. That's right. Blood pressure raising emotion. I'm gonna guess ire. And what goes on when your ire is raised? Ran on TV. I'm gonna say aired. Aired. Interesting as a movie role. Let's see. Well, we're guessing that this is calf muscle, right? Attendees that Achilles tendon attachment is the calf muscle, which again plays in today's theme. This is going to be upper canines' teeth. Um, meaty. I'm going to say meaty. It's a meaty roll. Yes, that's what they like. That's interesting. Most liked. Most liked. Casually. Most liked is fave. Fave. But yeah, maybe, maybe fave. We'll go with that. Well, that's my theory. That's my theory. Um, items, and the pest will go to the eyes, so it's gonna be eyes something. Lenny or Carl to Homer Simpson, to Homer Simpson. Those are coworkers, right? Don't they all work at the power plant? Coworker. Lab procedures, those are gonna be tests. Rocky or Alboa in Rocky. Those are, they're both boxers, I guess, boxer. If a tree falls in the forest and no one is around, if, does it still make a sound? If a carve as one's initials, etch. Encyclopedia of volumes or tomes. Homes. Bank account insured. I see the abbreviation on account. Okay. So therefore, the insurer, of course, is the infamous FDIC, Federal Deposit Insurance Corporation. Fraction of an inch is a mil. Mil. Uh, Solomon and Salon. Okay. Book cited in a sermon. I'm going to guess that's the Bible. Again, Bible has come up a couple times here in the last few days. Something to keep an eye on. Uh, tenderloin or T-bone are both steak cuts. I'm going to guess that's the answer. It fits. Sprayed graffiti on, say, you probably, you, uh, I don't know what that would be. Criticizes with down. Uh, puts down, cuts down, um, uh, bring down, criticizes though. Yes. Small role for a big star is of course Cam E O. Dam on the Nile, oh boy. It starts with an A and there's a W. And that's when I get lost. Ah, so close. A place for a martini, of course, is a bar. Pack overhead, stow would be my guess. Movie for a girl's night out. Well, that would, of course, be Chick Flick. Flick. And Chick, of course, well, hold on a second. <laughs> Sorry for that. Uh, Chick Flick. Um, lines up with today's theme barnyard babies chick is a barnyard baby so that's what we're on words of self-pity words i would say alas but that's one word so it's probably going to be um woe is me something like that have some munchies that's that um oh nash nosh right nosh Rotating workshop tool. Uh, rotor, let's see, cause of fever is flu. I'm gonna say lathe. It would lathe. Primatologist clue. That would be primatologist clue. Don't know that. Sport with Perry's. Okay. Sport with Perry's. Uh, well, a teenage, a teen outbreak is acne, right? Word with water, uh, body or beauty. Um, 
Beauty. Maybe this isn't a W. Beauty, because it's going to be shop, right? Body shop, beauty shop. Right? So it's EP. Uh, those, that's probably that EP thing. That's what we talked about the other day, where we talked about fencing. The sport with parries. Apparently, I don't know if parries means dulled end or whatever, but this is... If this is correct, this is like a fencing term that you see quite often. Turn topsy turvy. That's gonna be. Um, and then a do toy dog's perch looking down his lap, so that's gonna be upset. Necessitates a do over. Necessitates a do over, perhaps. Hmm. Okay. Let's go down. Cracked corn to chicken. Jimmy cracked corn and he gave it to the chickens, which is feed. They, they fed on it. Far from inept, able, calf muscle. We were correct on that assumption. Upper canines, eye teeth. Daily routines or habits. Lone shark's offense, usury. That's the offense of anybody. Lending out money is lending it out an interest. It uh, doesn't do a, a, a society good. I'll put it that way. Voice mail cue. That's a tone. Uh, blank airport. JFK or ORD TV fair. So it's going to be CNN airport. If you've ever been in the terminals there and had to wait there, they usually have CNN on. You there, hey. So apparently, uh, yes, uh, I think I, I recognize this now. Home to a pet rabbit is a hutch. Okay, more saintly, holier, a holy man. Uh, garbage scowl emanation is odor. Holy man, what movie is that from? Leave your guesses in the comments. Having a foul 11 down, ripe. When you, when, you have a, when you have a strong odor, that means you're ripe. And financial aid factor, we saw that earlier, that's gonna be need. So this is gonna be slope, right? Bunny, slope, and enjoy as a gourmet would is savor, of course. Okay, the Aesopian beast in a lion skin is an ass. And Kit's parents, Kit's parents, we had something to do with that the other day as well, but those are foxes. Uh, leaves, breathless, Oz, that's correct. Items or couples. Question after a bad joke. Get it? A bad joke, get it? Why isn't anybody laughing? I guess would be my theory, that's correct, okay. Let's move on. Uh, Icy Orbiter, those are allegedly comets. And Pesky Sibling is a kid brother. Pesky Sibling is a kid brother. And again, kid, that is, kids are baby goats, right? So we got bunnies, we got calves, we have chickens, and we have a kid. Uh, so there's today's theme. IRS submission option is e-file. Competed in a slalom, it's raced. Right. Well, yeah, competed. So we gotta look at tenses here. Not true, dude. Not true, bogus. Bogus, dude. Uh, negotiator's asset is tact. A clearance of smoke damaged goods, perhaps, is a fire sale. Yeah, of course sale animal whose spray has a foul 11 down this is the second reference we have to 11 down one right next to it and this right here, here of course is the epitome of not good smelling animals skunk a meal catchphrase BAM BAM Geronimo's tribe is Apache right, so this is puts yeah puts down cuts down and is this this is the, where the W is, right? Yeah, the dam on the Nala is the. I knew there was a W there somewhere. I just have to remember to put an S in there. And 
And let's see, like 40 across, sages, are wise. That's correct. I think this is the Solomon clue, right? Yeah, Solomon and Salon are both sages. You know, they're like wise men, wise kings, that kind of stuff. And there's another way of saying it, wise. Parts of a comic routine bits, that I'll go with that. Omar Sharif, Omar Sharif, know that one. I actually know him from, what is he from? He, well, he was in Funny Girl, right? But then he, wasn't he also the guy in uh, Dr. Shivago? Leaves the single life, leaves the single life, that's wets. And flu, so we just have the one, and flu, lap, that's right. And then, so we just have this, which is pie, the sprayed graffiti on his marred and market. And there we go, we got it. Less than 13 minutes, not too bad, 189 letters. Uh, barnyard babies, didn't leave much to the imagination. You kind of just guessed that it's gonna be certain animals and what they call them, and that was part of each answer is, was part of it was a barnyard baby. Calf, chick flick, and again, I'm, I'm probably going over this too quickly, but a lot of times you get a windmill effect. You have a cross right here, and then you're going down to this quadrant, going down, fire sale. No, kid, kid brother. So you have, this is 10 letters, this is 10 letters. Chick flick is 10 letters, of course. And then this one up here. So if you just picture, it's kind of like a windmill going around. And other times they're all fairly long, all across. Rarely will you see just down being the theme. Although occasionally, you never know. This is uh, this is a very very common way of putting in your theme. It's just the four long longest. Here, this one again the four longest answers. So anyway, hope you enjoyed today's puzzle and I look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Thank you.